Good morning. Let's take a nice breath in and a big sigh. Let breathing come back to normal, eyes opening. So welcome, good morning, welcome. My name is Drake. This is the Touching the Edge channel, and this is the Invitation to Genius, the 40-day practice, the Invitation to Genius, and it's an, it's it's an, a 40-day mutual encouragement, and, and 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 an exploration of genius. And right off the bat today, I just want to ask you to consider accessing joy today. I mean, really, access joy. I know it sounds silly. But let's get joyful today. And I want to suggest that when we talk about these broad terms, that we have to come up with specific metrics that that indicate the direction of moving towards that, moving towards joy. Now, joy and genius are so intimately linked together. There's, you know, when when it's like it's like play. You know, when you see a dolphin swimming, you know, it's so much like play. You know. When when, G, when G, genius is is like the play of the divine, right? You know, it's when we get out of the way and let the divine take take control, and we all of a sudden can dance better than we ever thought we could. We can write beyond what we could have ever imagined. You know, it's that process when you catch a glass before it falls off a ta- when it, when it falls off the table. You know, genius is that relationship. And joy is genius. So, you know, uh, you know, I, I often talk about how joy is one of my primary values. And to me, joy is about being on mission. You know, really having a sense of what your mission is in life and moving towards it in a way that's consistent. It doesn't have to be dramatic. It just has to be consistent, even when it's not consistent. <laughs> You know, there's always the resilience there that even if you get knocked off, you know you're going to get pulled back to your mission because you're truly committed. You you have to prove it to yourself. It's not about proving it to anyone else. So I'm asking you to access joy today. I'm asking you to truly ac- access what your values are. Consider writing down your values. What are your values? And then write down those elements that relate to those values. You know? And then write down specific actions that that move you towards those specific elements that relate to your values. Right. So, you know, if you you know, if you have the value of being creative, if being creative is one of your essential values, (coughs) what adds to your creativity? Well, maybe certain having certain tools around accessible adds to creativity. Uh, you know, writing down a specific plan and having specific dates that you're going to meet. You know, that's what that's what I do with my practice. I have, spe- you know, I have very big, grand, like joy and kindness and compassion. You know, positive indifference. And then I figure out, well, what does that mean if I was going to break that to mathematical variables? Not that things can bring you happiness, but doing the appropriate actions can prepare you to allow joy to to flow through you, which is actually the flow of genius. So I'm encouraging you to access joy today. Be joyous. And I'm also encouraging you in this 40 days to really consider that whatever happens is meant to happen during this time and use everything as grist from the mill. Everything as grist from the mill. So I want to show you something real quick before I let you go. So uh, I have a t-shirt on. Yeah. Science fiction bookstore, Uncle, Uncle Edgar's. All right, you know, again, as you can tell, I read a lot, and you know, uh, one of my first experiences of kind of coming to understand myself was when I was in the science fiction book club when I was in like sixth or seventh grade, and I looked around the room, and it was like all the dorks in the area were there, and that was that was when I was like, oh my god, I think I might be a dork, <laughs> but now I'm a car carrying adult dork. But I want to show you that because it's part of my motivation to access genius. This was my favorite uh, bookstore, and it burned down uh, last year after the George Floyd murder and um, and uh, you know everything that happened in Minneapolis here after that. So you know that was all in my neighborhood, and uh, this bookstore was burned down in that time. And so for me, this motivates me to access genius. This motivates me to to step up and do what I know I can do to make a difference. So how about you? 
Access genius today because when you do, you will find that you will be more joyful. It doesn't matter what it's in, you know. <clears throat> Move toward building something. Move towards improvement of some kind in some area. It could be something big or lots of small areas. But be joyful today. Thank you so much for your time. I really appreciate it. I really appreciate you. Um, you know, I know that uh, I'm a idiosyncratic individual, but I, I really appreciate you spending time. Thank you. I am filled with joy today, and that is a choice. I'm filled with joy today, and that makes me resilient. I bring my hands in the prayer position, I bow to you, and I say to you, namaste, live from the heart. Thank you, my friend.